हेलो गाइस वेलकम बैक टू अवर सीरीज ऑन ब्लूटूथ लो एनर्जी सो एज आई सेड इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो दैट वी विल बी स्निफिंग लाइव पैकेट्स ऑफ बीएलई सो इन दिस वीडियो वी विल सी व्हिच हार्डवेयर टू यूज एंड हाउ टू सेट अप द एनवायरनमेंट सो वी कैन स्निफ बीएलई डेटा यूजिंग दैट हार्डवेयर एट द एंड ऑफ दिस वीडियो आई विल शेयर वेयर आई हैव बॉट दिस हार्डवेयर फ्रॉम एंड सम जेन्युइन वेबसाइट्स फ्रॉम वेयर यू कैन बाय दिस हार्डवेयर so stay tuned and let's so the hardware we are talking about is nrf 52840 dongle which is from nordic semiconductor so i have used this hardware because i found it efficient compact and it is low cost so this nrf 52840 dongle is a small low cost usb dongle that supports bluetooth 5.4 bluetooth mesh thread zigbee 802.15.4 ANT and 2.4 gigahertz proprietary protocols before going forward we will understand why why to use this bluetooth device why to invest money in uh, purchasing this hardware so it is basically used to capture and analyze bli packets that are sent over the air it is useful to understand how a packet looks when sent over the air and get better understanding of the protocol it is also used for debugging and troubleshooting when you are building a bli application it can also be used for over the air attacks if your data packets are not encrypted an attacker can sniff the data and can send a malware between your bluetooth communication so let us start with setup there are basically three steps in first step we will uh, download the sniffer code given by this nordic and we will flash the code into this dongle in second step we will download and install the desktop pc tool uh, that is wireshark in the third step we will uh, install the nrf plugin in the wireshark so we have to download this uh, nrf code given by this nordic for this uh, dongle i will share this link in the description download the latest version so for me it is 4.1.1 so we will extract it here just go inside this folder all the hex files are here choose the appropriate hex file as per the hardware that we are using so we are using nrf 52840 dongle so this is our hex file now to flash the this hex file into the dongle we will need a tool which is nrf connect for desktop so we'll just download this tool we need to install this open this nrf connect for desktop install this programmer as we want to program the sniffer code into this dongle before doing before selecting this device uh, ensure that your dongle is connected to your laptop or pc this is my dongle it is automatically detected add the file see downloads and this is my hex file add this hex file and write you can erase and write as well but for me this option is disabled because previously i have uh, flashed the code into this dongle so i will write it and now the code is flashed into the dongle so our first step is complete our second step is to download the wireshark software for uh, your pc desktop for that you can download it from here i will share the link in description i am downloading this windows x64 installer here now let us install this wireshark so the wireshark is installed now so our second step is completed now third step is to add the nrf plugins to this wireshark so we can uh, sniff the data for bluetooth using nrf so now go to the software folder that we have 
downloaded at the beginning this one go in ext cap now we have to open a command prompt here just type cmd and press enter write this command and press enter okay so we are getting an error that pip3 is not recognized as an internal or external command so let us see how to resolve this if you are also facing the same issue just go to this script path that is it that is user your name app data local programs python python 39 32 and scripts inside the script you will see this pip3 so just copy this and paste it before this pip3 in the backslash hit enter so in my case it is showing requirement already satisfied as i have already previously run this command so if in your case if the, if the, if these tools are not installed then uh, it will get installed now we need to open wireshark so go in search wireshark help about wireshark folders your personal ext cap path double click on this if it prompts for the directory does not exist then click yes to create it now copy the content of our nrf sniff, sniffer ext cap that is all these content copy it and paste it in this wireshark x cap i have already done it now go to wireshark go to capture refresh interface view interface toolbar and enable this in my case it was already enabled now if you browse here you can see this nrf sniffer for bluetooth le you just double click on this it will start sniffing the ble data so it is capturing the all the data from my bele tv remote and set top box remote now the bonus thing where to buy this dongle now i would recommend you to check locally nearby your area if, if you can get this dongle there it will be good or else i have bought it from hubtronics in india i will share the link in the description you can go through that link and order your uh, this dongle it will cost around 1500 including the shipping charges and all if you can't find it locally or anywhere then you can just go to this website and here are the distributors of nordic all over the world you just click on this so region wise it will show you like in india you can buy it from digiki here it will be a bit expensive because their uh, shipping charges are more i put quantity 1 so if you can see 855 and 1200 are shipping charges so it will cost you more and i think delivery time is also more for this see you in next video till then if you find this video helpful do like and share this video and don't forget to subscribe our channel thank you